First settled for its natural resources, Door County's raw materials of stone, lumber, and fish were taken from the land and waters and shipped off to the growing new cities of the Midwest and beyond. Our community's natural beauty was being harvested and sent away as raw materials to build other communities. But just as the unsustainable boom of the extractive industry was busting, a new possibility presented itself, and in the late 1800s, tourism became a viable economic opportunity. Ever since then, the Door County community has worked to preserve its natural resources and its heritage in order to perpetuate and grow a healthy economy, better the visitor experience, and continue to improve the quality of life for its local residents. The tourism economy has experienced its shares of ups and downs. In 2005, it hit one of its low points and the livelihoods of the local residents were in jeopardy. In an effort to restabilize the tourism economy and rebuild the infrastructure that supported visitors and locals alike, the business community partnered with local governments and started to implement a countywide room tax in 2007. Since then, room tax dollars have been an integral part in the purchase of land and waterfront to expand and enhance access to shorelines and open spaces. Starting with the purchase of Helms Four Seasons Hotel in Sister Bay, other communities have followed suit and in the years to come, Liberty Grove, Sturgeon Bay, Bailey's Harbor, Fish Creek, Jackson Port, the village of Egg Harbor, and the county of Door would follow with substantial purchases of their own. In 15 years, local governments have spent more than $26 million on shoreline purchases, opening up 128 acres and 2,700 feet of shoreline frontage to the public. Along with these acquisitions come improvements like better accessibility, playgrounds, pavilions, boardwalks, and kayak launches. In that same period of time, thousands of acres of forests, bluffs, wetlands, and open spaces have been added to the public realm thanks to the efforts of the Door County Land Trust, the Nature Conservancy, and the Wisconsin Department of Natural Resources. It is these collective investments in Door County that improve the quality of life for residents and the experience for the visitor which in turn creates more funding to preserve more shorelines and more open space for public use. Prior to 2005, our individual municipalities, business and community associations competed with one another. The economic downturn served as a unifying force and our community leaders discovered common ground. They shared ideas and experiences and began to move forward together. In 2007, the former Door County Chamber of Commerce evolved into the Door County Visitor Bureau, which is now known as Destination Door County, and they became the leading voice for promotion of our community. Over the following 15 years, our business community, local governments, and visitors all have seen growth. All along, the community coordinators have worked together to create a bridge between visitors, local residents, and municipal governments with the goal of improving life for us all. With this growth came significant improvements for the local residents and visitors alike. Improvements like public park additions and expansions in Bailey's Harbor, Sister Bay, and Sturgeon Bay. Sustainability initiatives gained a foothold across the county with communities of Egg Harbor, Ephraim, and Fish Creek acquiring green tier designations as well as electrical vehicle charging stations have become commonplace. Door County communities gain more public waterfront in communities like Bailey's Harbor, Gills Rock, Egg Harbor, Fish Creek, Jackson Port, and Sister Bay than in any other time in our community's history. Playgrounds have been expanded. Dog parks have been added. The infrastructure of the county has been vastly upgraded with improved transportation and walkability in Jackson Port, Fish Creek, Sister Bay, Ephraim, and Sturgeon Bay. In addition, major broadband initiatives are underway, paving the way for the next generation of internet connectivity. Preservation of our culture and history has taken center stage in Sturgeon Bay, Fish Creek, Sister Bay, and Ephraim, as coordinated efforts with their local historical societies have helped preserve irreplaceable historical structures for future generations. Outdoor recreation opportunities in Southern Dora have become more accessible year-round. Festivals and events such as Death's Door Barbecue on Washington Island have expanded to provide a more diverse offering for visitors as well as residents. Not only have the traditional festivals continued to go strong and bring visitors to us in the shoulder seasons, but the community-focused programming at the Door Community Auditorium and Crest Pavilion have also been added to enrich residents' lives. Overall, 
These efforts benefit the Door County community as a whole. Balancing the needs of the locals, businesses, and our visitors will continue to be a challenge. How well we all work together, plan, listen, and collaborate will determine what kind of home we will have in the future. Door County is well positioned. The community coordinators, local government, and Destination Door County are all committed to preserving and advancing this community we all love. The future of our community is bright, and the best is yet to come.